Hi, beautiful people. This is Melanie with Raising Cades. And today I've got a Costco haul for you. Let's do it. Hello, beautiful people. So I just got back from Costco. Um, Costco was fun today. I don't know why everybody was at Costco today, but everybody was at Costco today. Were you at Costco today? Because I was at Costco today and everybody in our area clearly was at Costco today. But anyway, I love Costco. I would be a Costco if I could be a Costco because I just love Costco that much. Um, I hadn't been to Costco in a while. I typically go to Costco about once or twice a month. It's a little bit further away for me than Sam's Club is, but I still choose to go there because they have a lot of things that I cannot get at my local Sam's. And frankly, Costco is a whole vibe. I mean, it's just a whole vibe. Even though I got a fight for my life in Costco, I still love Costco. Anyway, so let's go through, see what I got. I want you to guess my total at the end. Keep in mind, I'm feeding 10 people, mostly three times a day. Um, so I'm not a hoarder. <laughs> um, and honestly, this is not even everything I got to get. I still got to run to Publix. Um, but anyway, all right, let's, let's just do it. All right, here we go. So I like to get these little apple juices. They, this is the best apple juice ever on the planet. Ever, ever, ever. Do your kids get these and like bite them because they sound like apples when you bite the plastic? My kids do that just nasty but anyway they do that um so i saw this today so we like to do this thing called taste challenge in our family where we try something new and this is definitely new for us so this is octopus fried rice and it's a spicy rice um it says it's a korean stir fried rice that combines the perfect charm of chewy octopus and sweet and spicy red pepper sauce. So we'll do this for dinner one night. Um, that should be interesting. We'll probably do a TikTok um, and Facebook Reel and Instagram, all that great stuff um, of us trying this one. It's gotta be a lot of fun. I got two of those because if my kids like it, then we'll stick one in the deep freezer, then eat later. Cause like I said, we live very, very far away from Costco. Um, got some potatoes. Um, I got some baking potatoes because we do a baked potato bar once a week. I got the mini potatoes to go with some meat that I got, and you'll see that in just a minute. I got some sweet potatoes because I do sweet potatoes as a side. I got some guacamole. I love getting these individual guacamole cups from Costco. Um, number one, they're really yummy. Number two, they're priced really well. Um, and so I like getting the individual cups. Little ones, it doesn't go to waste as fast as if I got just a big vat of guacamole. So that's why I do that. So then I got two of these Motor City Pizza Company Ultimate Meat Pizzas, Detroit style deep dish pizzas. My family says that these are absolutely yummy and worth every penny um i don't remember how much they cost but i'll post the total i mean i'll post the cost of these below but they're really good and just two of these can feed my family um a couple of my kids don't eat meat so they won't eat from this i got them um a vegetable pizza and you'll see that in just a minute um i got yo play yogurt 24 cups in here i want to say this was like seven dollars on sale for the whole box so that was a great deal um, that I always have to get yogurt. Some of my little kids eat yogurt for breakfast, lunch, and dinner if they could. But anyway, so yeah, we have to have yogurt. Um, I'm going to skip over this meat. We picked up some Pocky. These are little breadsticks with um, cream covered breadsticks. Yeah, little cream covered breadsticks and my kids love them so I just got those as a quick snack um we were completely out of hot chocolate Christmas just ruined you know our whole stash of hot chocolate so I had to re-up on that um we got 50 packs of hot chocolate in there and I want to say that was like ten dollars um one of my kids asked for queso 
and I usually get our queso from Sam's Club, so we've never tried this one. Um, and I was not in the mood to go to Sam's Club today. Actually, I was on a time constraint because we have something, um, a show to be at this evening, so I didn't have time to go to Sam's Club. So I just got this one, and hopefully he'll like it. Um, then I got some Worcestershire sauce, Worcestershire sauce, War, War, Worcestershire sauce. Say that 10 times fast, I dare you. Um, got that for some steak that I bought. We'll marinate that and stick it on the Blackstone or on the charcoal grill, I don't know. Got some cucumber bites. My kids like to snack on these. And then I got some English cucumbers for our salad bar. Got some tomatoes for the salad bar. Got some already uh, shelled, is it shelled or is it peeled? I don't know. Anyway, I got some pomegranate in the cups. Um, Anita likes to take these in her lunch sometimes, and then sometimes I will pull this out when we have yogurt for breakfast as a topping for yogurt. Um, and I just like them when in the little individual cups like that because again, less goes to waste that way. I got blue agave because I'm fancy. And really, I put this in my sugar, I mean, excuse me, put it in my sugar. Put this in my coffee as a sweetener. I got some grapefruit. I eat grapefruit for breakfast or a snack sometime. I love grapefruit. I got some dried mango. My kids have already torn into that. But um, yeah, they were actually giving out samples of these at Costco today. You know, Costco is the king of samples. I love Costco. Did I tell y'all I love Costco? I just love Costco. I got these mini fruit bars. These are good. Um, they only have two ingredients. And they satisfy that sweet tooth where you just need some, or feel like you just need something sweet, um, just a little something. And it's not, they don't have as much sugar as gummies. Um, so I'll give my kids some of these sometimes as a snack. This is the vegetarian pizza I was telling you about. So it's got cauliflower crust and roasted vegetables on top. Anita and Maddie will eat that because they do not eat meat. Speaking of meat, let's go over here and look at our meat. So as for our meats, I got some Koneka sausage because that is a necessity, right? Right, Koneka is life. You know, we went to the Koneka factory um, in Evergreen, Alabama on our way back from vacation one time. I think it was last year, 2022, yeah. That was cool, that was awesome. Um, I got some Canadian bacon also known as ham, but it's really Canadian bacon. We'll do some breakfast with that. I got some steak. Um, and I know you're thinking like, what are you gonna do with four steaks? But these are really, really thick. And so I'll dice these up and um, we'll do burrito bowls with this. And that'll be really good. Um, that'll probably last us two meals, if you believe it, for our family of 10, eight meat eaters this will probably go through two meals for us. So yeah, that's that was a good price for those. So I'll dice these up and probably throw them on the black stone and then do burrito bowls. Whoop. Then I picked up some salmon. We do fish. What is this on this fish? What is that? I'm gonna have to look at it. Oh, okay, that's just part of skin that they didn't peel off. But anyway, um, so I got some salmon because we do fish one night a week. Um, this will only last us one meal. Um, I have another um, fish fillet in the freezer downstairs, and then I've got some tuna in there, so we'll be good on salmon, fish, and whatever for the next couple weeks, but this will do this week sometime. Um, I picked up this. I love getting this from Costco, and I haven't been able to find it. People have told me that Sam's Club sells it like this, but I always get it at Costco because they always have it. And I like to do uh, Philly cheese steaks with some. I like to do, um, I don't know, just steak sandwiches. Like, I don't know. Then we'll do maybe some uh, stir fry with this, but we'll get probably, I'll divide this in half. We'll probably get two meals out of this. I'll divide it in half and we'll probably do um, Philly cheese steaks with one half and probably do stir fry with the other half another time, but I'll just divide it up into Ziplocs and put it in the freezer. So here's our ground beef. Um, this will last us 
probably two meals. Maybe, yeah, about two meals. Let's see. This is almost seven pounds of ground beef. So yeah, for us, it'll be about two meals. I'll probably do burgers and I don't know, something else. But we'll knock that out, put half in the freezer, half in the fridge. Um, I always have to have stuff for sandwiches in my fridge. We do do sandwiches one night a week. Um, and then sometimes Richard will take sandwiches for lunch. So I always have to have sandwich stuff and I love getting it from Costco because it's so fresh and it's so good. Um, so this is roast beef. Then I got turkey breast. I got two things of turkey breast. Um, and so that'll last us for the next couple weeks. Then I got some bacon because bacon is bacon and we need bacon. All right, moving on to the fruit. These are called pine berries and I have not tried them, um, but apparently some of my kids have because this one looks a little empty and they just brought the groceries in. But have you ever had pine berries? If you have, let me know. Let me know how they taste because I don't know how I feel about these. <laughs> I just, I don't know how I feel about them, but we'll see. Then of course got some strawberries, got some broccoli. I'll, uh, that'll last us through two meals for sure. Um, I got some of the artisan romaine because I'm fancy like that. This will go in our salad bar. Got some asparagus to go with some of those steaks that I got. Got some mini peppers that'll go in our salad bar and the kids will just snack on those. I got strawberry and yogurt flavor pretzels. As if we did not just leave holiday season eating all the good stuff, but yeah, I had to get those. Um, I got, I like to, when I go to Costco or Sam's, I like to get some of their ready-made meals because after grocery shopping and putting it up and all that great stuff, nobody wants to cook. So I can just heat this up and we can have that for dinner. Um, I got bacon crumbles. I got two bags of bacon crumbles because we need those for our potato bars. Sometimes kids put them in grits for breakfast, all sorts of stuff on the salads, all sorts of stuff. So yeah, that's that. I got these crispy vegetable spring rolls because the other day one of my kids wanted to make spring rolls and I couldn't find the stuff to make them. So we'll try those um, just to see how they taste. I got this yakisoba stir fry. Again, one of Costco's ready-made meals, like you just take it home and prepare it real quick. We've had it before, but it's been a long time. I'll probably do a TikTok and Instagram with this. Um, let's see what else we got. Mango nectar. Mango nectar, we like that stuff. Um, milk, we already had some milk, but I just got another one to re-up. Got some grapes, not enough grapes, because I didn't like the way their um, other grapes look. Anyway, I only got one of those. Um, got some mandarin oranges. And then I got this mozzarella snacking cheese. These are really good too. Um, sometimes I get the, I forget what they're called. Oh, Baby Bell, yeah, Baby Bell. Sometimes I get Baby Bell and then um, sometimes I get these and this time I just chose to get these. And the cream of the crop. I scored some eggs. No need to cheer me all on, I scored some eggs. Got some eggs. There are 60 eggs in here, so five dozen eggs. And I wanna say it was, uh, I think it was $12 because I know they came out about $3 a dozen, which is the best price I've seen on eggs in like forever. And they had a limit of two. So I got two of these. They probably left one out in the car. But yeah, I'm winning just because of this right here. All right. So, so that's what I got at Costco today. Now we've got to put it all up. Yeah, we got to put it all up. That should be fun. Then we're gonna run to, um, one of my advertisers is having an event and there's the puppy wants to go outside with the kids. Um, so we've got to run to a show this evening, which should be a lot of fun. We're actually going to see Bluey. Um, so we're gonna put all our groceries away and I hope to see you next time. Oh, yeah. So our total, our grand total today was about 760 something. I don't know, I'll put the total there or there. 
I'll put the total somewhere up in here. Um, yeah, and so again, this is not even everything we'll need for the next two weeks. So of course, I'll need to re-up on our fruits and vegetables, um, re-up on milk. Um, There's some other things we need to get, like, um, I don't know, just some seasonings and things like that that we were out of. Um, and I'll do that at Publix after the show this evening. Um, and I'll probably do a video with that too. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you hit that subscription button and I hope to see you next time.